everyone and welcome back to Mars for another action figure review. Today we have Storm Collectibles Baki Hanma and I gotta say this may be figure of the year for Storm Collectibles. Now why do I say that? I say that for three reasons. Number one, Baki is probably the most articulated figure to be released from Storm Collectibles to date. Number two, I believe this is the first figure to feature soft goods from Storm Collectibles. And the final reason is because the price is so great for this release. Coming in at, at $78 with that amount of price for the figure you're getting, again, this may be figure of the year. Now, if you've been following me for a while, you know I am a fan of smaller packaging and Storm Collectibles did deliver. Check out the packaging, very small and well appropriated okay so the packaging it, this figure so far seemingly checks off all the boxes for figure of the year so let's get into it well before we get into it would i recommend you this figure the answer is yes i mean it's baki everyone should know baki and if you don't know baki go check out the netflix series that's a great starting point and yeah so let's get into this review Going over the presentation, you can see Baki Storm Collectible, sorry, Storm Collectibles captures the likeness so well with Baki. The shading on this figure is extraordinary. The paint is good, the soft goods really sticks to the figure. With Oma from Kang and Ashra that was released last year, which was my figure of the year for last year. He did not have soft goods, so when you went to put his leg up, for an example, like look at that. When you went to go put up his leg, it just got hindered with the soft plastic. So with the soft goods, this is a huge step up for Storm Collectibles. Without wasting any time, let's go ahead and jump into the articulation. So Boggy can look up this much. He can look down this much. There. He can lean side to side. And the head does turn all the way around. No issues there. Now for T pose. There we go here. Look at that, man. Just oh, you gotta love storm collectibles, right? So here is your T pose. He is double jointed but remember because of the muscle it's not gonna get that full mobility bicep swivel is there you have your butterfly joint as well arm can rotate all the way around yeah just a really nice figure now someone had commented one time because I had mentioned this like issue here that I'm having I think they said to push it together and it would fix it. I'm not sure. But yeah, like these sleeves. I'm always having a tr like trouble with the sleeves with these figures, so. That's just me and how I handle the figure. I'm trying to get it looking nice for you all here. Well. No matter. Let's continue. So. Arm articulation, flawless. The wrist does rotate and it does hinge as well. Now, something else that comes with Baki is you're going to be getting, you are going to be getting wrist pegs. From, from like the first time ever, I believe, with Storm Collectibles, they're giving you additional wrist pegs just in case they break with this figure you have two extra ones that come with Baki again a huge step up for Tamashi uh, not Tamashi Nations but a huge step up for Storm Collectibles you can tell all I've been reviewing is Tamashi Nation products because I said Tamashi Nations <laughs> anyways getting into it here with the ab crunch he can crutch in this much on the upper torso, 
lean back this much with the upper torso and then for that full range that's what you're getting here it's pretty decent and then going back oh yeah there you go look at the muscle definition the shading and the paint I mean it's just it's all there for Baki even in the, in the legs I haven't even touched up on the legs yet okay so there's that uh, he can rotate at the waist as well. So let's get down into the legs here, the lower half of the articulation. And the figure feels really good too, by the way. So as you know, he can hit the nine. Oh, okay. Wow, so my leg did come off. All right, so he can hit the 90 degree. Well, it's a little less than 90, but it's mostly there. I mean, really it's like 88 degrees, but good enough. They can also extend it up like this as well. So the articulation is there with the legs. Now let's try the splits. Oh yeah, for the splits. Hold on. Let's see here. Uh oh. Have I encountered a key C issue? Or is it just mishandling? So the splits is decent. Look at that. Great split. Okay. Now let's get into the knees. Double jointed knees here. There is a leg swivel. But the leg keeps coming off. Let me try the other leg now. So hold on. Let me just adjust it real quick. And see, this is like much easier to handle with than the Oma figure. Okay, so here he is here. Double jointed knees. And the leg swivel is there, but it's very minimal. Nothing at the thighs. Let's just try to get him up in a pose real quick and see how he, how he fares. So there he goes, posed up. Pretty easy. You've seen how I did that. Okay. So yeah. There is a leg swivel. He can do the split. You have double jointed knees. Um, just be careful. It seems like maybe one of the legs will come off pretty easily. And then for the feet, looks like there is some rockers. That's very good. We got some rockers. He's got his toe pivot as well, and it does extend out. So great feet movement there. So I've seen a lot of people like on Instagram put his foot all the way up like so. So let's see if I can do that here on camera for you all today. Booyah, there it is. So he can do the pose very easily. Articulation, flawless from Storm Collectibles. Now, let's move into the accessories. All right, starting off with the head sculpts, you're going to get your neutral head sculpt here. Looking very good, nicely detailed, as you can see. So let's move into the next head sculpt. You're gonna get a total of four head sculpts, by the way. Here's his other head sculpt, pretty much like his kind of like cocky, smirking head sculpt. Cause you know, he knows he's like one of the strongest in the world. Which, by the way, his father has been confirmed. Just, I think right now the license is pending, but expect him hopefully next year. Now here's his face, more of a pissed off face here. Still nicely detailed. Okay, and then our last one. <laughs> it's a good one. Again, Storm Collectible did a great job capturing the likeness I like that okay so yeah he's gonna come with a total of four head sculpts and then five pairs of hands so let's go ahead and move into the hands here all right for starters you're going to have your closed fist 
for his hands. Pretty standard, you know, always need to punch somebody. Next up are going to be these closed fists here, but more of a fighting stance, his particular fighting stance with the hands. Our third pair of hands is going to be his open grippling hands, because remember it is Baki the Grappler. Okay. And then our fourth pair of hands is going to be just open relaxed hands, just your hands. And then our last pair of hands is going to be our opening, um, again, kind of like blocking hands. A lot of open hands. You're going to get three pairs of open hands and then two that are closed fists. Semi. And then that's going to do it. He doesn't come with any special effect pieces. It's just going to be his hands. It's going to be the hands and then the additional wrist pegs, which is awesome. I hope more companies would do something like this for their figures. And then that is going to be it for all of Baki. So let's go to the conclusion. All right, everyone, to conclude this review, yes, I highly recommend picking up this Baki figure because you're not going to find a Baki figure like this anywhere else. The, articula the articulation is flawless. The soft goods is a nice addition. The small packaging is very welcoming. And for the price of $78, it just, again, checks off all the boxes. Now, I will say I am a bit disappointed with the leg continuously coming off. I think it's just me being rough with the figure, maybe. I don't think it's going to be a problem for everyone. I actually have another Baki figure on the way. So, I could always pull that one out and check and see how the leg is. Um, with that being said, everyone... Uh, this has been the Baki review. I usually don't like to ask you all to subscribe, but if you don't mind subscribing, that would be great. The channel is almost at a thousand subscribers, and I would love to hit that thousand mark before the two year anniversary of Mars, which is I think August 17th, maybe. So, yeah, make sure to hit that subscribe button, comment below, and let me know if you're going to be picking up this Baki figure, and let's just enjoy it. The wind is blowing out here. The nature is this incredible. And yeah, thanks for joining Mars. We will see you next time. Peace. I hope you've enjoyed your time here on Mars. If you enjoyed the video, consider subscribing. And if you like, check out my playlist relating to the toy line. Thank you again, and I look forward to seeing you soon.